Hello everyone, it's me ASMR welcoming you to my new Photoshop tutorials and today I'll show you the photo editing process. So let's start the tutorial. Uh, if you're new in my channel, please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notifications. So let's get into it. Here this one uh, is a raw image and that is the raw uh, camera filter 13.2. It's open it up and then here the option open as object press ctrl or command j it will make copy by uh, another layer over here right press and restyle as the layer and after that going to the filter and camera filter so this one is another plugins of the photoshop if you want to get the download link of the camera please check out my video description from here uh, lots of preset over here i made some preset for you guys here from here which one is perfect and will customize from the asm uh those are my uh, preset here is 17 and 16 so 16 preset uh number and now we'll uh, make this one a little bit changes from here going to the color mixture from here saturation of the red i'll increase too much and the orange a little bit up yellow a little bit okay that's fine and from the basic options i'll make it a little bit cool from here making the exposure a little bit down contrast a little bit up and the blacks a little bit up and dehaze a little bit up so in a phase you are getting uh, some warm things so that going to the color mixture again going to the luminance making the yellow orange a little bit up and red a little bit down so that's why you are getting here that red prominent before and after you are getting the changes like that so after that in this portion optic geometric i didn't use in a effects option uh vignetting that is minus 11 and the calibration all the steps are like that uh, here the primary of the blue primary minus 12 so let's discuss about all the steps how the setting will be like that in this portion you're getting the temperature minus 7 and here the exposure uh, 0. 0 and the contrast 16 highlights uh, plus 39 and the shadow that is uh, 70 47 actually the whites 4 and black 17 and here dh plus 9 and vibrance 0 and saturation 0 now going to the curve option here the input value 0 output value 34 input value 41 and output value 44 and the input value here 116 and output value 105 and input value that is 184 yeah, actually 196 and output value 184 input value that is 255 and output value 240 that's good and the detailing option here the sharpening of the amount that is 81 and the noise reduction 14 and the color noise that is 90 from here the color mixture uh, here the hue which color will be defines with the hue saturation uh, here the percentage of the color and luminance intensity of the color from the hue portion we are getting the red plus 25 orange minus 13 yellow minus 60 green uh, that is uh, plus 62 and aqua uh, plus 69 and the blues minus 30 and the saturation plus 59 orange minus 5 yellow that is minus 17 and the uh, green minus 80 and the aqua plus 45 and the blue that is 43 and luminance minus 19 and orange plus 21 yellow plus 25 and here the green that is plus 30 and aqua plus 50 and here uh, the blue that is uh, plus 15 that's good in a color grading portion you know uh, which color will be in a shadow which color will be in a highlight and the mid-tone these three depends on the, sh the color grading actually the shadow portion we are getting the, the color code that is 2 to 1 and the saturation that means the percentage of the color 11 and here highlight we are using here 57 value if you change it out it will change drastically so I'll suggest you to keep this value 57 and the saturation 24 that's good and from the effects already uh, discussed and here the blue primary already discussed and hit the ok button before that I'll save it out for you guys and I'll provide you that preset download link in my video description so check it out the preset for downloading and don't forget to give the credit line of me okay I'm saving this one and uh, saving as uh, like beauty or uh, something else uh, here 
and hit the ok button we are getting the changes the before and after huge change and after that going to the filter again and going to the nick collection and color fix pro 4 here i'm using the cross processing this one and here lots of sub method which one is perfect for your photography uh, you have to use that so l03 and strength i'll keep it only nine or six percent and then hit okay it will take several seconds and it will load it up and providing you the final output which is really cool and amazing so let's see the before one and after one huge change so hope that you learn a lot from this video if you did please thumbs up and share with your friend and if you have any kind of question query or request please do comment on my video comment section and if you want to get the download link of this preset please check out my video description don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon today asmr is signing out stay safe stay happy and healthy keep me in your prayers as well bye bye